Francis Charlotte Greenwood, June 25, 1890 to December 28, 1977, was an American actress and dancer. Born in Philadelphia, Greenwood started in vaudeville and starred on Broadway, movies, and radio. Standing around six feet tall, she was best known for her long legs and high kicks. She earned the unique praise of being, in her words, the only woman in the world who could kick a giraffe in the eye." In 1913, Oliver Morosco cast her as Queen Anne Sophith of Ugabu late in the run of L. Frank Baum and Louis F. Gottschalk's The Tick-Tock Man of Oz better known in its novelization as Tick-Tock of Oz. In 1916, Morosco commissioned a successful star vehicle stage play titled So Long Letty. In 1919 Morosco brought her back in the sequel Linga Longa Letty. This role made her a star, she reprised it in the 1929 movie of the same name. She appeared with such luminaries as Charles Ruggles, Betty Grable, Jimmy Durante, Eddie Cantor, Buster Keaton, and Carmen Miranda. Most of Greenwood's best work was done on the stage, and was lauded by such critics as James Agate, Alexander Woolcott, and Claudia Cassidy. One of her most successful roles was that of Juno in Cole Porter's Out of This World, in which she introduced the Porter classic, I Sleep Easier Now. She had some discomforts with that play, as she had become a devout Christian scientist and feared the play was too risque. One of her last movie roles was singing and dancing as the feisty matriarch, Aunt Ella, in the film adaptation of Rogers and Hammerstein's Oklahoma. 1955 Radio <inaudible> 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 Greenwood had her own radio program, The Charlotte Greenwood Show, a situation comedy. It was broadcast 1944–1946, first on ABC and later on NBC. She also was in, "...Home in Indiana", on Lux Radio Theater October 2, 1944. Recordings Greenwood ventured into recorded music with an album of songs from Cole Porter's musical Out of This World and another from the musical comedy O, oh, by Jingo. <laughs> Death Charlotte Greenwood died in Los Angeles, California from undisclosed causes, aged 87. Marriages She was married twice, first, to actor Cyril Ring, brother of actress Blanche Ring, and secondly to composer Martin Bruns. The first union ended in divorce, the second with Brune's death. Both unions were childless. <laughs> <laughs> Partial filmography <laughs> <laughs>